to the channel. Welcome if you are new. It is awesome to have you. Happy holidays. Happy Vlogmas. Today I am sharing with you guys what is in my kids stocking. Now for those of you who are new and don't know, I have two kids. I have a daughter who is two and a half. She'll be three relatively soon. I have a son who's five and a half. I also have a 12 year old nephew that I do a stocking for. He usually stays with us either Christmas Eve or Christmas Day. So we always fill a nice juicy stocking for him. And I'm going to show you what I got all three children. Now, my box is chock full and this isn't even filled to the top a lot of stuff is spread out on the floor now i do collect stocking stuffers pretty much all year round if i see it and it looks like a great idea for stocking stuffer i usually grab it put it in a box because if i don't use it for stockings i can always do it as a treat a birthday present gift it to another child if we have to go to a spontaneous birthday party so i always kind of have a little bin full of goodies especially if i find stuff on sale i usually stash it in my little stocking box and i'm all set to go for the holiday season full disclosure um, I brought these socks up from my basement for the thumbnail uh, the thumbnail picture for this video However, these are not the stockings that I typically use this one I'll use for max every once in a while, but they do have pottery barn stockings that I absolutely adore I bought them about two years ago or three years ago at this point and they light up Penny has it's like a ballerina fairy one and then Max is a Santa Claus. So let's jump into the haul. I always start with youngest to oldest. So I'm going to start with my daughter Penny uh, who is two and a half and let me show you what I got. She's been into Frozen for the last year. I can't shake her like into something else. She likes Encanto. She likes now she's liking Rapunzel from Tangled uh, but Frozen she always goes back to it. So I got her this cute little watch on Shop Disney and it has Anna and Elsa there on the face. It's Velcro and you know it's adjustable for little wrists. So I thought this was super Super cute it's technically her first watch and it's frozen so she's gonna love it again this is a shop Disney find and it does come in this beautiful little Disney box with Mickey and Minnie on there I originally purchased these at flash deals or sale the princess one Target was running a promotion and I bought this for six dollars and then the my little pony one went on super flash sale on Amazon for like Black Friday they uh, put this on sale for about six dollars and sixty cents so I thought that was a great deal she loves the slap bracelets and I love the little boxes we put other things in there so she has a frozen set that I bought her for her birthday last year and she loves them so I think she's gonna love these as well I can never pronounce these Numos, Nemos, Nuimos I don't know Disney released these they're amazing because you can change their outfits and it's kind of like a little dress up thing they're kind of small for the price but I just thought they were so cute and Penny loves Frozen so Anna and Elsa I got her these for her collection look at the detail on Elsa she has the little cape there and all the little sparkles she looks fantastic so I'm excited to add these to Penny stocking I came across these bitty boots speakers on amazon.com I couldn't believe for a speaker how tiny and how inexpensive but how loud and how good they sound they have amazing reviews on Amazon they have all different characters including Star Wars characters Disney characters you name it they have it Marvel characters uh, but again Penny's into Frozen so I decided to get her Elsa because that's her favorite sister little speaker for her bedroom a lot of times we listen to music or Christmas music and I have to play it from my phone it doesn't sound the same so I figured I would put a little Bluetooth speaker like on her dresser and then that way when we're just hanging out in her room I can connect my phone or the iPad and we can listen to some music together all right so Penelope is getting super into makeup she loves watching me do it and then she gets the makeup sponge and she wants to do it I know she's super young for makeup but I think it's just an imitation phase all little kids go through it however I did buy her a few lip balms uh, and lip glosses for her stocking because we all need some moisture on those lips this I found at Ulta Beauty it is by the cream shop I have seen these at Marshall's and TJ Maxx so you can totally find these at a better price I just saw uh, this flavor here with Hello Kitty and the little strawberry and I thought super cute. This I found at Ulta. It has the little polar bears. It is the Coca-Cola bear and it comes with three different chopsticks. There's the vanilla, there's the cherry and I thought this was super cute for some lip moisture and it's going to taste, you know, sweet and fun. Last item uh, for lip product is a Lip Smackers lip gloss. This I found at Target. I found this actually in store and it was very inexpensive. It's called Unicorn Sparkle and that's what it looks like. It has a little unicorn on front. So if your little girl loves unicorns, she'll love these lip smackers. Oh gosh, I'm may have gotten her too much lip product I found one more I forgot I bought this I bought this a while ago this is also lip smacker it's like this little whimsical reindeer which is super cute it's pink and purple she's gonna love it it says oh what fun and it is candy cane so it's gonna have a nice minty flavor which is always my favorite chapstick or lip balm in the winter time I love the mint another shop Disney find I feel like you can also find these at Target if they have the Disney store inside it is a liquid vessel <laughs> a cup with a straw and I like it because it flips up here she's actually had three of these before and I love it 
because it has Olaf on the bottom. See there? And he's just like floating around. She loves these containers. They're fun for her to use and whatever keeps her hydrated, I'll get it. Toothbrushes, I always add dental hygiene to my kids' stocking, especially with all the candy that they get in there. So I picked up this Oral-B um, Elsa electric toothbrush. I'm not sure how she's gonna take it, but we'll try it. Uh, a lot of kids like them, a lot of kids enjoy using them, and they really get the teeth squeaky clean. And then I also did get her a Blue's Clues, one of those timer toothbrushes. Um, if you hit the button, they light up and then it'll keep going off until you're pretty much done brushing your teeth. I found this adorable little hat at Target and it has a little rainbow, it's red, pom-pom. She loves hats, like she runs around the house wearing hats, so I figured this would be cute for her. Um, I like it because it's fleece lined. So this is actually gonna be super, super warm. These I also picked up about two months ago at Target. They are frozen slippers. So they have Anna and Elsa and they're furry. They look like little glamorous, you know, fuzzy slippers. She's gonna love these. She loves all the princess stuff. They have the little gems there in the bows. It also has that fur on the inside. So they're gonna be nice and warm if you live in a colder state. What's a Christmas stocking without a pair of cozy socks? I found these at The Gap when I did the friends and family sale. I just picked up Minnie Mouse because she loves Minnie. She loves everything Disney, just like her mama. And they're just fuzzy. They have a little grip Bees. We love these. Oh boy. Two more hats for Miss Penelope. I totally forgot that I got these. Vans, we went into the store. My husband was looking for sneakers. Penelope saw this. She put it on and she was screaming because she didn't want to take it off. And she's like, hat, hat, love hat. And I, it just broke my heart. So I was like, you want that hat? You want to look like a little skater girl? I'm not gonna fight you on that, let's get it. They were also running a deal, so um, I picked this up and I figured I'll hold on to it to add to her stocking. And then this unicorn hat here, how cute is this? This one is super warm. I wish I could you know, fit into this, it's so adorable. It has like that Sherpa on the inside, so this is super warm for those cold winter months. And it has a little sleeping unicorn eyes and the little unicorn horn there. It has a little fur mohawk on the back there, so I thought this was super cute. This was an Ulta Beauty find. It is a little spa bow. I have tons of them. and. Penny loves them and I feel like they're a little big on her. This one I opened it in store and I feel like it runs kind of small. This is like perfect for her head and it's a little white cat. So I thought this was super cute. She loves wearing the spa bows. They keep her hair out of her face and she likes doing the little skin routines with me. So I figured why not get her her own little spa bow at Ulta and I got this for $7. One more little knickknacky item. These are those items that you're like, why did I buy them? They're probably just gonna end up in the trash in a month, but it is what it is. Christmas only comes one time a year. Let's just go for it. Um, my kids love these. They're like sensory. It's gonna make a lot of noise, so. See, they do that crunchy thing. I think all kids love these pop tubes. They are a lot of fun. They had a two pack of these for $5. How cute are these? The kicker on them? They light up. So Santa lights up, the snowman lights up. They're super cute. I have one for each child. Max will get Santa, Penny will get the snowman or vice versa, it doesn't matter. Oh my gosh, I almost forgot about these. So I picked these little light things up on QVC.com. I know they suck me in all the time, but these things are amazing. They're three in the pack and they're like little night lights, but they're like silicone and jelly-like and they come in these amazing little night figures like stars and moons. You turn it on here and then when you tap it, it changes color. So if you see it kind of turns like that orange red I don't know if it's reading on the camera then green then there's also the cloud which is super cute let me turn him on so you can see there's the cloud the cloud is white again you tap it on the top the color will change tap it again turns green tap it again turns blue tap it again red amazing so again you press the button it'll go off there is the moon which is probably my favorite I think the moon is so cute maybe I'll keep the moon for myself but there you go it turns white then red then green then blue. Doesn't require batteries, you literally charge them with USB. I thought these would be great for the kids' bedrooms for little night lights. Okay, moving on to my five and a half year old Max. I got him quite a few things. His stocking has less stuff, but more expensive stuff because these games are not cheap. So the family is gifting Mr. Max a Nintendo Switch Lite. It'll be his first video game. That's why we're starting him out with the light. See how he does. So I picked up a few Switch video games on the Black Friday sale on both Amazon and Target. I picked up Animal Crossing, great reviews. People were saying for around Max's age range that this is a fantastic game. And then SpongeBob and Cars. My son loves racing and cars and anything that is on wheels and moves. So I think he's really gonna enjoy this. Squishmallows, I love Squishmallows. My kids love them. Penny's getting like three bigger ones that are Disney princess. 
Don't get me started. So Max didn't get a Squishmallow, so I figured let's give this uh, little Santa one to him. I found this at Home Goods. How cute is this little Pikachu hat? So Max started watching this YouTuber who plays video games, uh, but he does like Thomas the Train video games and like building tracks, nothing intense, but he is such an adorable creator and he actually wears this little Pikachu hat. So when he scores in the game or does something good or passes to a new level, he um, he squeezes the bulb on the hat and that the ear pops up, which I thought was super cute and Max loves when he does it. So I went on Amazon.com and I found the hat. So I can't wait to give this to Max. I hope he'll wear it. If not, Penny will probably wear it because she loves hats. We couldn't get a Vans hat for Miss Penny and not get one for Max. So I picked this classic one up. Max looks so handsome in this hat, can I just say? I might be biased because he's my son, but he looks like an adorable little skater boy. Oh, so cute. So I picked this up for him because it was just too cute to leave behind. Also picked up some cozy socks for Max at the uh, friends and family sale at The Gap. These are Chewbacca from Star Wars. These were so inexpensive. I couldn't believe the price that I got these for. I think they were like $2, so they were must have. Also have the grippies on there, super warm and plus for the winter months. He will love those. Max loves Hot Wheels and cars and anything that goes room room. So I figured I would get him one of these like limited release Masters of the Universe uh, Hot Wheels that you can't really find everywhere. I did find this one on Amazon. Again, dental hygiene. I also picked up two toothbrushes for Mr. Max. So we got him this Star Wars one. We'll see how it goes. And then um, if that doesn't go well, I did get him some Firefly toothbrushes. These also have that timer light up. So if you press the button there, you'll see they light up. So I do have a few books here which technically won't fit in stockings so I found this one here for my kids to share because they both love Elf. I love Elf too. It's like creeped up to like my top five favorite Christmas movies. It has great illustrations. I'll open it here so you can get an idea of what it kind of looks like in there and it's the story of Elf and I think my kids are really going to enjoy this book. This book here is the second time my kids have it. Uh, they love it. The first one is completely destroyed. I found it on Amazon for four dollars and my husband's like check out now get it because the kids love that book. Uh, it's a flat book and the little parts come up. If your kid likes Christmas in the Grinch they will most likely love this book. Last but not least, uh, how trains work. I might actually wrap this up for Max because I feel like this is borderline gift. But it is a book on how trains work. They also make one for planes. Highly reviewed. Everybody loves this. My sister actually bought him the planes one, which she's going to gift to him for Christmas. Uh, and yeah, I'm going to link it below because if your kid is really into trains, they're going to enjoy this book. I promise you. All right, guys. Now the stuff for my nephew. Um, there's not a lot of stuff here. There actually are a few items that I'm waiting for in the mail um, which haven't come yet including a hat I found these stranger things stickers he is recently into stranger things he's like obsessed with it and they're just different um, different stickers you know like the kids on the bike they have um, 11 there they have ego this one here just says stranger things so I thought this was just cool for him to stick on his notebooks the OG entertainment I mean I could sit with this for a long time I could never solve it but I could sit there for at least 15 minutes and try. So I figured my, my nephew's pretty smart. He's good with these puzzly things. So I think it's time for him to have a Rubik's Cube. I found it on Super Sale on Amazon. My nephew is really into Legos. If you saw my What I Got My Kids For Christmas video, you will know he got tons of Lego sets. But I found this one that's Santa Claus so he can put it together while he's at our house. Uh, yeah, it's six plus, has 69 pieces, so it's a decent amount. What a great idea for a stocking stuffer. So this is a cute little Lego set that actually fits in his stocking. It is Black Panther. I found this on Target.com. He loves all the Marvel characters, so he'll love this. This is an Amazon find. It is one of those sensory pens. So it has like that liquid, you know, that moves up and down, but it's also a functional pen. These are so adorable. I almost want one for myself. I might actually order this again because I like to have fun pens um, on my desk for work. And then they have different characters on the actual pencil themselves. Like you got Santa Claus there um, and they have a smell. I think they smell like sugar plum or candy cane or whatever it says on top for the candy. It's a good amount of candy. I haven't figured out how I'm gonna divide it up. I've been into fancy chocolate lately. I, for some reason, like Twix and Snickers and Kit Kats, they just don't taste the same to me. I'm like, am I getting old? I just don't like these candies anymore. I want like Lindt or Kinder, like the German chocolate. And it's Christmas time, so I figured let's get the fancy chocolate for the kids. This is a bundle of Kinder chocolates. This is the snowman theme. It does come with quite a few here, so we can divide this up for several stockings. Penny loves the uh, Kinder Joy 
eggs. They have the little prize on the inside. So I got this little cute choo-choo train. So these are more like the adult chocolates. I don't know if I'm gonna put these in any of the kids' stockings. I might actually put these in my like Christmas chocolate bowl that I like to put on the dining table. But this would also make a great stocking stuffer for an adult, maybe for your husband, for your wife, for anybody. These are delicious. And I love that you get the one-off Santa and then you have all the little bunnies here. So I thought this was super cute. I did pick up another set of the Lint Snowmen. These go very quickly in my house, so they might make it in a stocking. We might eat it before, we don't know. These are amazing. I get them every single year. I usually keep them for myself, but this year I'm going to gift one to Penny and one to Max because they're my kids and they deserve it. So I got the Santa one, super adorable. I got the bear one. I did buy these in my local supermarket, but I think you might be able to pick these up at Target or like a specialty supermarket. Last but not least for candy, we have Frosty the Snowman. These are so cute. I actually saw these last year when one of the parents in my son's class did like gift bags for the other students and they put this in each gift bag, which I thought was super, super awesome. And I was like, I have to find those Frosty ones. I got one for each kid. This one has the classic Frosty there with the corn cup pipe. This one has Frosty there with his little friends and it's filled with chocolate, little milk chocolates. They're like little coins. All right, guys, cheers. I am drinking iced coffee this morning. It's just that kind of day. It's freezing outside, but mm, we're doing iced coffee in my Mama Claus cup because that's how we roll. All right, that's everything in my kids' stockings. Wasn't that fun? I love doing these videos. I hope that you enjoy watching. If you do, don't forget to hit that red subscribe button and like this video. You can also find me on Instagram at the name is Jeanette. Happy holidays, happy vlogmas, and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye.